Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're going to talk about the parking brake assembly for the 78 and 79 model aircraft. A lot of people haven't seen it. A lot of people are retrofitting it to earlier models. And let's talk a little bit about it. Here's the basic assembly. Let's talk about something brand new for the GPA for a minute, and that would be Patreon. And here we have a link that shows the normal logo, but you'll notice that the orange logo is on the website. Um, it allows people to voluntarily donate money to our cause, making videos to support Grumman Aircraft. You have the little caps in the top with the springs with the little lobes that attach to the uh, shaft, which is how you lock the parking brake. Here's the shaft been removed from out of the assembly. Notice that you'll have three O-rings right there to um, clean up and to overhaul and change. Also, here's a look down into the well where those um, tappet bodies go in there to work with the uh, cam lobes to lock it. And here's the spring assembly that holds those lock tappets down in the bottom. And while you're doing all that on the lock on the tappet body, there is an O-ring that you need to change. And you can either use the uh, standard O-rings that are fit for it, or you can get the mill spec ones. And then you just put it all back together. Depending upon your mechanic, I'll have his choice of number for those. And then you put it all back together, you start cleaning up the assembly a little bit, check the hardware, probably repaint it. So we hope you had this look at the parking brake useful and informative. Thank you so much for watching, and have a good day flying your Grumman.